Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to talk about um, a muffin which is made from uh, Palaji biscuits. So, this is the Palaji biscuit. So, I have 16 biscuits over here. So, it's good for making a couple of muffins. So, if you want more, you can add more biscuits over here so that it can increase the base of our uh, muffins. Okay, so I have like uh, 16 biscuits. I have uh, the Nandini Good Life milk for mixing it. And then I have a uh, Herschel's chocolate syrup. And then I have uh, Nestle Classic uh, Instant Coffee. Um, and I'm using you know you know uh, as a you know, baking uh, soda. And I'm using baking powder a little bit. So this is these two things I went and shopped for. Um, so baking powder and some chocolate chips. So these two things I guess you need to run uh, across your supermarket and get this. You know, of course, it was already always there. And, uh, these biscuits I brought it for lockdown, which I never used it actually. So let me grind this up and I'll let you know. So before ground uh, grinding this up, so what I'm doing is like I'm putting the baking powder into this mixture, so I don't have to you know separately mix it up, or you can just do it later as well. And then I'm putting the baking soda, which is you know as well. This reduces my overall task but it's like it, it, so i don't have to be scared that i'm afraid uh, you know i might forget to add this so i'm adding this um you know this uh nescafe instant coffee powder as well so that uh, i will get some coffee flavor also in this one let me just grind this okay so I have uh, just uh, grinded that uh, you can see the amount of uh, you know powder I have so in this one just add a little bit of milk and um, try to make it a dough okay so that's what we want to do uh, don't, don't add anything else just the milk and this one okay and make it a dough the, as of now so that's that's all you need to do you can see that I have made it like a dough. Okay, you can see it's sticky and uh, it's well uh, nourished with uh, milk. You can see the moisture in here. So this is very good for baking. Um, so I would recommend you to keep it like 15 minutes in the fridge, refrigerator, so so that uh, the moisture can well settle inside uh, these, uh, you know, this dough, and uh, it will raise up a little bit. So. So I'm just gonna put this in our fridge. Taking the dough from the fridge, it looks like this. Okay, so you can also use your hands instead of spoon uh, if you're comfortable with. I really don't care uh, what I use until you get that right. So now. Uh, what I'm gonna do is like there is also a parallel uh, thing is going on in my kitchen, so that's why you see other things as well. Um, well, so now pour the chocolate syrup on that. Now, how much ever you like. Um, if you are a chocolate fan, then there is no limit to it. And then you can pour the syrup, chocolate chips, and everything you like. And then you can mix it one more time. Just stick a small mix, not too much. Uh, of a mix is required at this point of time because we want to have this chocolate chips on top of the muffin so you can decide however you like it okay so i mixed it like this with the spoon itself uh, but uh, you can use your hand because when you're putting it in the tray right so you have to use your hand so it's up to you how you want to do it and uh, you can uh, get this kind of a tray uh, for uh, baking muffins especially so I'm just gonna use these two uh, trays because it's not much so I'm just gonna use these two trays and uh, before you use it just apply a little butter on it or ghee on it whatever you have so that it doesn't stick to it so that uh, when you're removing it it becomes pretty easy for you you can see the drop of butter see the drop of button uh, butter I have uh, provided here uh, so I'm just gonna apply it okay. now I have uh, started to um, you know make this down and put it in this tray 
so this is done so I have done that so now you can take few of the chocolate chips and you can just put it on top of it just that it looks good when it comes out okay so this is something which you really don't want to do which you don't want to do but I'm just doing it to try out what happens because we already have chocolate chips in there so this is just extra thing so now I'm gonna put it in the oven I don't have really the size of the oven so I uh, this is a grill tray so I'm just putting on top of it and then inserting it um, now you see the settings are pretty simple so you can preheat this oven which I uh, normally almost every time I forget to do it so uh, anyway so uh, settings for the oven is very simple should be between 150 to 200 okay so it's over here which is I guess 175 to 80 and then you should uh, point it towards down so which is uh, uh, talks about the only the bottom two rods are gonna be uh, on heat and then keep it for 20 22 25 minutes so there you go so let's see what happens so the the 22 minutes to 25 minutes is over so now open this and you can see the size of the muffin it looks really looks like a muffin though I'm just gonna remove them and you can see the additional chocolate chips we added on top of it so just coming out to be really nice um, so yeah that's a good thing so I'm just gonna remove this slowly okay I'm gonna put it here it's really hot so oops okay so here you go the actual muffin which I was talking about so you have both of them okay I'm shifting to another plate which has more space so there you go so I want to cut it and show you how it looks inside You can see the smoke coming out. And you can see that one looks very much uh, uh, cooked. And you can see it's very delicious, right? To look, even to look at it. And uh, I'm pretty sure that it would taste really amazing. So I'm just trying this. It's much of it. Hmm. It's really sweet. And there's a flavor of coffee in it. And there's chocolate everywhere. So it's nice, it's pretty crispy. You let it warm for some time and then you can go and dig in. Thanks for watching this video. Uh, do try out this recipe. I'm pretty sure it's, it's really good.